Hi, folks. We got a good question for Jason here, and this one is about uh, doors and storefront. So what I'm going to do in my project, I'm just playing around with. I'm going to select this wall, and I'm going to change this wall type. And I'm going to make this a, I'm going to select it first, sorry. I'm going to select this wall, and I'm going to change this wall to a storefront. And I'm going to join that, and there we go. So there's our our, our wall. So to, to do this, we need to add into this project the type of doors we want. So I'm going to go here, I'm going to go architecture, insert. Sorry, insert low family. And I want to select these three doors. Now these doors are loaded into my project. So now what I want to do here is this is why we can't. Now I'm gonna go here, I'm gonna go to the architecture tab and I'm gonna place a door. See the single flush will fit there there but nothing's happening over here okay and I'm gonna tell you why we need special doors for curtain walls so what I'm gonna do here is now to fix this now there are a couple of things we can do so let's look at this edit type so in our properties here on the grid layout we got a maximum space of five feet that's a bit small so I'm going to go here and I'm going to say, make this six feet. Okay, a second here. There we go. Make that six and apply. And we'll go okay. Now we could have did that afterwards. So. Now we've got our, our spacing, so let's go here, let's take it, say we want to put a door here in the middle. So what happens is we have to select this mullion, unpin it, and just delete it. And then we have to select tab to that panel, that glass, unpin that, and then go here to edit type, and go and find our window. So we will go with the double glass here It'll put okay and there's our double glass door now I'll put this fine view and there's our door with the handles and everything so now let's go here let's do another one so let's select let's place one right here again we do we unpin this and delete it then we tab to the panel we'll do a single here unpin this and then we'll select we'll tab to the glass we got it selected and edit type gonna type properties and we'll go with single glass okay and there you go that's simple folks and then again, we can also, that's a pretty big door. So we can go and do this now. We can also come here and select this. And we can edit this, these mullion widths. So let's say five here, apply. Okay. Let's go back to our six. Now let's do the third and final one. Um, let me put this back at six. Now let's do, we've got this one, this one, and let's go here. Let's place another one here. Let's unpin this. Delete it. Select tab to the panel. Unpin it, and then I want to go here. I want to edit this type, 
Let's see what we'll have here. Oops, we'll go here with the double glass. I think we got the single glass here. Okay. And we did that one. So we can also go here and change this type from from you know we can go here edit type. Let's go double storefront. Okay. And there. So there we got our three different type of doors, and that's how you do that. So good question, Jason. Uh, everybody, thanks for watching the video, and I'll see you in the next video. So until then, everybody be safe, and I'll see y'all. Bye.